Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I wanted to show you guys how I blow dry my hair. So I just adopted this new routine of blow drying my hair. I Previously, I did not put heat on my hair for like a year, year and a half. Only on special occasions is when I would put heat on my hair but I wanted to change that. I wanted to look more put together and what better way than doing your hair. And doing your hair meaning the most simple thing to do because I really don't have time to sit here and literally curl every strand of hair. So I just like the blow dry look too. I think it looks super professional. It's so simple and you just look so put together with minimal effort so if you guys want to see that plus how i kind of like care for my oily thin hair then please keep on watching so i'm gonna just give you guys a little bit of backstory of my hair products that i use and then we can jump right into the blow drying process so i have very straight slash wavy hair it's thin and gets super oily i kind of wash my hair twice a week i want to say i used to wash it like every other day and then i was like no pretty you have to stop because i found that i was drying out the ends and it was just not good for my hair so i had to like kind of like train my hair to control the oil production because my scalp is so oily so now i'm down to doing this twice a week and first things first i'm going to share the shampoo that i use because i believe in this brand so much and it's not function of beauty there is a little bit of you know tea with that brand but i i have never used function of beauty i i don't know if i ever will because of what i've heard but the shampoo that i do use is the love beauty and planet shampoos this is what they look like and this is the shampoo and this is the conditioner and they made these out of well they put the shampoo and conditioner in reusable bottles so when you're done with both products you can actually use this for something else you can take off the label and use these bottles for something else they're so sustainable and they're vegan and cruelty free they also they also use natural coconut oil and natural coconut water ethically sourced mimosa and it's safe for colored hair and it has plant-based detanglers and there's no parabens silicones or dyes inside of this and the one that i get because there's different types the one that i like to get is oh it's the coconut water and mimosa one i think this one is targeted for thin hair it's supposed to give like body to your hair because if i just did nothing with it it would just lay flat so yeah this is what they look like and these are honestly so big it lasts me for months and i get these at target and they smell so good i kid you not i would wash my hair today and the day after tomorrow it would still be smelling like this so i absolutely recommend checking out their line because they honestly have some really 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 great hair products for such an affordable price the second thing that I want to recommend to you guys is this the original Olaplex hair perfector. I get this at Sephora. I absolutely love this. I use this before I shampoo and condition my hair. And by the way, side note, I don't shampoo first. I actually condition first because I don't want the conditioner to weigh down on my hair. So that's why I condition first and then I shampoo first. But when I'm using the Olaplex, which I do this like once a week if I remember, I do the Olaplex first, then I do the conditioner, and then I shampoo two times. I always have to do it two times because I feel like if I just do it once, then there will still be leftover oil inside my scalp. So I do it twice. And I love this. I absolutely love this. You can get this at Sephora. They recommend you do this before shampooing because it's a bond builder and they want you to leave it on for a minimum of 10 minutes. And trust me when I say this, your hair will literally come out perfect whether you do something to it or not and if you have damaged hair this is a godsend because you will literally nurse your hair back to life with 
just this product so i can't rave about this enough i used to use this with just towel dry hair and go and my hair honestly i would get compliments from so many people on that particular day so guys i have like if you guys take away one thing from this video is to get this product fourth thing that i will recommend to you guys is this scalp brush i absolutely love this i wish i can tell you what brand this is from but i really can't find it on here because i will definitely i would have definitely give credit to that brand but i just cannot find it i just use it like this and i just massage my scalp when i'm shampooing my hair and i do this because i have such an oily scalp and also i kind of like to put oils and leave-in conditioners in my hair throughout the week just so i can get rid of the frizz and stuff like that so i like to use this just to get everything out of my scalp because again i do have very 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 oily scalp and there is a lot of product buildup and this just helps to remove all of that so i like this one because it has like a silicone type of brush and so the bristles bend that way i know that when i'm using this it's not really breaking any of my hair from my scalp i don't want to do that because i don't want to thin out my already thinned hair i've also used brushes that these are made out of like very thick plastic where these do not bend and i found that i was literally balding while i was shampooing my hair so i just like this because my hair can move through it freely and i honestly guys this is a must-have in your hair routine it will change the game for you trust me if you're washing your hair every other day this is key to training your hair so you don't have to do that the fifth thing i want to recommend is a hair towel now this i got in my boxy charm a couple of years ago and i still have it i wash it about once a month but i absolutely love this and i i just don't know where my hair routine would be without it because i don't want to use the same towel that i use for my body on my hair i definitely don't want to do that because that one i feel is more abrasive to my hair and this just honestly takes out so much water it absorbs so much water so i usually use this when i first get out i will basically turn my head down if that makes sense and basically squeeze some of the water out and then i will put this on like that and just twist down here and there is this little thing i will just latch it on to here and honestly that's not a good depiction but that's the best i can do if you guys don't have this for your hair routine i definitely recommend getting one honestly a lot of these things i got from tj maxx tj maxx is the plug for hair care there's so many things that i found in tj maxx that i have in this kind of routine like this um i've seen this i've gotten one from my mom from tj maxx and yeah i think that oh and and the hair dryer i also got from tj maxx can't wait for you guys to this see that is what like the sixth item that i'm recommending for you guys honestly i i don't use all these products religiously i do it on my self-care day which is usually on sunday i make sure i incorporate all these products into my routine when i'm washing my hair on a sunday um and trust me the result is phenomenal so the sixth thing that i will be recommending to you guys is this it's a 10 miracle leave-in conditioner um but i have the light version because again i have a very oily i have a very oily scalp and the light version just it's just all the ingredients that are incorporated in the regular it's 10 but much lighter if that makes sense because they don't want to weigh your hair down and it does not weigh my hair down and it says this it's a 10 it does 10 things instantly enhances a natural body weightless detangler adds silkiness adds shine humidity resistance color protector helps prevent split ends and eliminates a frizz thermal protector and 
environmental protection and I use this as a thermal protector when I am blow drying or straightening or curling my hair and honestly there's no damage to this hair there is no damage to this hair so definitely recommend this if you are in need of any of these 10 things and I usually put this on with a paddle brush I've had this brush for years literally since probably like 2005 and I just basically spritz it like that on it oh you didn't even see that like one more spritz okay like that and I just start from the bottom and I work my way from to the top I just basically comb up my hair out like this There are two reasons that I start from the bottom and then work my way to the top. The first reason is I start from the bottom because I want to prevent as much breakage as possible. When water hits your hair, your hair becomes very, 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 what's the word? Prone to breakage, I guess. Um, it, it becomes very prone to breakage, so that's why I start from the bottom and then work my way up because I want to preserve as much of my hair as possible because I want as much body as possible. The second reason is because I want to focus most of my product that are that's on the brush on the bottom of my hair and then work my way up and get as little product on my scalp as possible because again I don't want it to become too oily. Oh, I just realized I had my AirPods and let me just take this out guys. And now that we have basically combed through our hair, it's going to make the blow drying process so much easier because it won't be stuck in a part of our hair. Um, so first things first, I'm going to show you guys the blow dryer. So this is the blow dryer and it's by the brand of Foxy Bay. I picked this up at TJ Maxx and honestly it was worth every dollar because... It's shaped like a paddle brush, no not like a paddle brush, like a blow dryer brush and it just literally take like it takes half the time a normal blow dryer would because you're directly putting the heat onto your hair if you know what I mean because with the paddle brush not really but really but this this you can directly get the product anywhere on your head with the heat i'm just gonna take a scrunchie and by the way if you guys want these scrunchies i give them away with every order from beauty by pizza so if you guys want to shop with me i'll leave a link down below and i just go from the top of my ears which is over here and this is my first section this will be my first section and i'll just basically bring this entire Part and I'll make a little bun with it and then I'm going to plug in my blow dryer and go ham honestly
So now I'm gonna take the paddle brush again and just brush everything out. And honestly, that's it. I This process does not take me a long time and I just wanted to say, I know I should have put a disclaimer at the beginning of my video, but I am not a hairstylist. I didn't go to school for this. This is just what works for me. This is the routine I adopted for myself based on my hair. Blow drying time will obviously vary based on your hair type, whether you have curly hair, thick hair, thin hair, you know, all that stuff. So I did, I'm not a professional, not a professional. Um, but I have been doing my own hair. I don't have my own personal hairstylist or I don't go get my hair done regularly. So just keep that in mind. I just do this based on, you know, YouTube videos that I've seen um, and go from there. And this is how it came out. I am in love with blow drying my hair. Like this is something that I see myself doing every single time or almost every single time depending if i have time i see myself doing every single time i wash my hair um and like that thank you guys for watching if you guys like this video please give it a big thumbs up it really helps me out i really enjoy making videos like these and i honestly will try and open up my schedule to making more videos because honestly i truly enjoy doing this for you guys um subscribe to my channel if you guys are new and turn on your post notifications if you guys want to be notified every time i post a new video and like that i'll see you guys in the next video bye